All right, uh, using grass clippings to grow grass on a septic drain field after three years. You'll notice the side on the right is, uh, is has a little more bare patches and then the side on the left. And the side on the left, I made sure I put, I just used a bunch of grass clippings that I had extra. Kind of like what you see here on the ground. I had just had a bunch extra. This is June 2021. 20, and so I just threw it all along this side and you see like there's the grass clippings just from um, throwing them all there just over the last two years and so and then there's kind of like a lot of weeds because um, I didn't actually seed it or anything um, but there's grass too and then as you get to the back side uh, it's all pretty much evenly bad um, Although, I've been just throwing random dirt and stuff back here, so this isn't really part of the experiment. Um, everything over the septic mound uh, kind of does well. And then there's like this bare patch back here. Uh, and bare, it's just bare over here. And this is where I did not use the grass clippings. So as you can see down there, it's like a little bit better. Now, there's one outlier, well an outlying factor is that during the morning, as you can kind of see right now, just a little bit, that side gets sun earlier. So that could be an outlying factor, but in general throwing the grass clippings on just gave it more biomass. Um, so there's the information for you.